Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Exploring the Blockchain. I am your host, Polly, and today we are going to be looking into the KuCoin community chain. So what is the KuCoin community chain? It's an EVM-compatible and high-performance chain that was started by the KuCoin community. So right off the rip, we get into Mojito Swap. Mojito Swap is one of their nicest DEXs, and I think the DEX to be on if you're going to be on the KuCoin community chain. So right off the rip, we see that I have nothing here at all, but we get to see a lot of available stuff like Pencil. Oh, look at that, Pencil DAO. They're also releasing a few other things constantly too, but we go into the swap and you got their native KuCoin token. You got the wrapped version of it, but you got a lot of other coins here that are available, just like um, regular tokens, pretty much. See, like you got ETH, you got Curve, you got Bitcoin, KuCoin version, you got Baby Doge, if you're into that. And then you can go over to the bars and you got to do uh, Dual Ming. So in Dual Ming, you do the Pencil and KuCoin. Um, pair and you're gonna get mojito and pencil at the same time and then you go over to your wine bars and you can just stake your mojito earn 56.99 percent apr or get it and stake it and then it auto recompounds on itself for 76.8 percent apy that's not bad at all but you then got the launch pad here which is what I was looking into before. You got Pika Star, a new game coming out. I think that's going to be some something pretty good. It's looking like it has kind of a Pokemon aspect going to it. Let's just check out their website quick. So yeah. You, you see it's got this kind of Pokemon little vibe going to it. We go in. And there could be something good here, but who knows? Truly play it and truly earn. One can only hope. But they have a whole roadmap and everything. This could be a real thing, who knows? Who knows? Then they got Idle Stone Age and Cool Mining. Oh, that's the Koha token. Okay, okay, okay. But that's uh that's mojito swap on the kucoin community chain and then we got ku swap as well and look at these they released some projects here we're right on the launch pad ku acorn dot finance and ku swap dot finance but let's see what they have available in the uh swap area here and as you can tell they got bnb oh they even got crow wow that's actually pretty crazy they got crow they got chronos Okay, so uh, yeah, KuCoin's starting to do some cool stuff. Look, Kudos. Nice. So then you also got the farms here. And look at that. 82.42% APR. There's some good APRs in here. 246. Nice. Nice. That's what we're looking for. That's what gets us excited. Oh, those aren't that good of rates. 2796 and... Then auto compounding 33.55. Okay, Ku earn Ku Acorn as well. Look at that. You just have to stake Kua and Q KCS, which is the native KuCoin token. Then you got Ku Drops here. You got Lottery. You got Vaults here. Nice. That's what we're looking for. Okay, so 188.18% APY. 0.2904% daily. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. But yeah, you have vaults here on uh, KuSwap. That's where you want to go if you want to get in on those vaults. But I don't really know where there's like lending available on here, if there is any. And they even got an NFT marketplace. Let's check this out. Look at this. KuCoin Loman. Okay. A trading bot? Okay. Haha, <laughs> these are uh, pretty cool. So I guess this is like the native uh, KuCoin ones. Because uh, I did hear about these somewhere else. 
Then if you want more sketchy coins, you can go over to Kudex. Kudex has a launch pad, and let's see what they've come up with. They've come up with Giant Panda, which I'm pretty sure failed. We'll look into the website after. But yeah, they come up with a lot more sketchy stuff. And let's check out what they got in their exchange. So they got BNB, they got all these tokens. They got Cafe, even Cafe came over to KuCoin as well. Okay. But yeah, they also got this paper thing, which uh, I think is uh, another tomb fork. Because, yeah, there we go. Look at that paper. Let's see if we can go over to... Oh, no, let's add liquidity. Damn. They don't have an easy way to access the paper website. But I'm pretty sure that's another tomb fork right there that you guys could have gotten in on. And it's a pretty good one. Well, I think all tomb forks are good, honestly. <laughs> but yeah, this is where you'll get all your sketchier coins on KuCoin Community Chain. But then we go over to that one other sketchy coin we found was Giant Panda. And I think it's just another reflex to reflection token, which uh, basically gives you uh, back tokens for just holding it so you hold it in your wallet and you collect more of these giant panda tokens but let's check out the chart because it doesn't even load and that's how you can also find sketchier projects honestly when nothing on the fucking website loads so then we go over to kucoin ku doge sorry the first proper doge coin on kcc the doge coin of the kucoin community nice so they got their own coin, uh, community coin for Doge, called Kudoge. Nice. Anti-whale, look at that. I just don't believe that's possible. Look at that. <clears throat> Launch supply, one quadrillion. Current supply, 828.9 trillion. It's getting closer there. It's getting closer to being done but let's see what they have on their actual app oh, okay so they got an exchange referral swap look at that refer new members and get a bonus wow kudos is minting mint up to a maximum of 30 nfts at once at a price of 2 kcs per kudos nice so one kudoji is 2 kcs that's really not expensive at all at least they're trying. At least they're trying. They're trying more than an actual doge. Look at these kudojis. Nice. It's only one or two. It's like only two KCS. Okay. That's pretty cool. And then what? They got vaults? Oh yeah, look. They got auto compounding vaults. Nice. That I did not expect through kudos. But yeah. They got auto compounding vaults. So then we go over to another sketchier portion of the KCS, Pencil DAO. Oh, look at this. And then you go over into stake, and that's not bad at all. 29.84% APR. Okay. So yeah, this is Pencil DAO. They're not doing too bad. They're still holding at 40. Look at that. But they're basically going with the general sentiment of the market and everything in the market's going down, so they are too. Maybe they come back, who knows. But yeah, this is KuCoin uh, Community Chain, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.